Well, turning now to Hollywood award season. And during this time, we remember the first Mexican-born actor to win an Oscar. Gil Reyes shows us the recently restored Pope of Broadway mural, honoring the late, great Anthony Quinn. Many people say it's Anthony Quinn's greatest film, and that's saying a lot. 1964's Zorba the Greek captivated movie audiences and even inspired artist Eloy Torres to paint the 70-foot-tall Zorba mural in downtown Los Angeles. That was in 1985. More recently, what's known as the Pope of Broadway mural received a much-needed makeover. I'm, I'm happy with it. Uh, I pumped up the colors a little bit because in anticipation of that it's going to fade because it's south-facing wall, so it gets a lot of sun. Here's how it looked before the spruce up. Here's how it looks today. Torres worked with Quinn's family, a restoration expert, and Councilman Jose Huizar to restore its original look. The entire process took about eight years. This artwork is not only a tribute to the two-time Academy Award-winning actor, but also, if you look closely, his arms are outstretched. The artist intended this to be a sort of welcoming gesture for all people of Los Angeles. By the way, Anthony Quinn had also performed nearby at the Million Dollar Theater, which is also here in downtown L.A. For him to make it the way he did at the time he, he did, where uh, people were not as accepting of Latinos in Hollywood, um, it's a great thing to uh, honor such a great man, honor such a great mural. Oscar-nominated actor Edward James Olmos is also a big fan of Anthony Quinn's and the mural. Art really breathes life into humanity, and um, we need it, and this is going to be very inspirational. When people go by, they're going to just be very happy. <laughs> And they won't even know why. They'll just look at it and go, wow, look at how beautiful that is. In downtown Los Angeles, I'm Gil Reyes for LA This Week. And you can see the Pope of Broadway mural live and in person at 3rd and Broadway in downtown.